Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to get free music, free movies, audiobooks, ebooks, videos, and a lot of other stuff. And this is just for like newbies, people that ain't too computer literate, you know, that don't know a lot of the basics of computer, you know, how, how it operates. And if you just want music, you know, if you just want to get some videos or music or the latest you know newest music that's out there well I'm gonna show you how to get this program it's real easy I mean it's and it and it doesn't seed and what seed means is it doesn't like track your computer like when you download something you have the option to seed or not to seed in this particular program and the name of it is Frostwire so I'm gonna show you how to install it and run it on your computer and um, you can download it for uh, Max, Ubuntu you know whatever you got you know whatever you're using you can download it and it's real simple and it's not full of a bunch of malware so let me walk you through it and I may pause the video from time to time to show you you know because sometimes I have poor service and it's a lag of my internet so well you go to any web browser for me I'm using Microsoft Edge it's the newest one that comes with Windows 10 so you type in frost and I already have it there so it'll come up and when you search for it make sure you go to the official site here I mean cuz there's several to choose from down here and of course when you go to them you know you have different things that they probably want to throw in and try to you know get you to download along with this but when you go to the official site it doesn't have as many so let me show you how to do it so you click on that <clears throat> and it'll bring you to this page here and then you scroll down and you'll see that it's good for you know you can even do it on Android and you know I don't know how to do that and these others here I guess if you're in another country or something but anyway, so you can scroll down to easy downloads or, you know, you, this little tutorial shows you how to, you know, to, you know, what the benefits are of it and compared to different torrent um, programs that are out there. But we can skip all that. We can just go to downloads. And then when you get here, and more stuff and just click on what you got so I got windows and as you can see down here it's downloading and it's downloading pretty fast so I may not have to pause it because the internet's doing good today so let's see and you can save it once you you know I've got it saved in my downloads so see you can open the folder view downloads or run I'm gonna just hit run cuz and then a course bring you this page and you have to click yes cuz this is your computer asking you do you want to run this and you say yes so so you can exit out of there now you've come to this setup page and of course if you're in another country you know or you want to put it in Spanish or whatever there that is so but Go to the next. You you can read that if you like. I don't. Here are these different things that they try to get you to put on there. And of course, I don't do that, so I don't click on none of them. And you know, it's set up so it looks like you would have to click on it to get the program. But no, you go to next, and then make sure you read this carefully and unclick on it because this is another program, Pro PC Cleaner and that's just some more bloatware that comes with the program that you can not have so make sure you uncheck that box and continue and then you know of course it's gonna this is gonna be where it's gonna be installed on your computer see destination there and, all. and you can change that if you click here you know you can go to whatever and that's you know you can even store it on your desktop if you like I guess but we're gonna keep it there cuz that's the default and install shouldn't take that long you know like I said my uh, DSN is working great 
so, so I get bad days and good days with our service here in Tennessee so then you know here's the last page of it you know and you can click run you know or you don't have to run it now but I usually just go ahead and run it and it takes you to that that's the internet right here take telling you thank you for buying it but I'm not gonna get that so and then you'll read this this is just telling you what it is and all that and do not pay for it because people were trying to charge for this at one time and I guess you know Frostwire found out about it because they were making money off of it and it's a free product so hit next and then right here it's just telling you where your documents will be saved you know you can change it where you want and it says seed now this is important too I don't seed because I'm just using it for music to get the music and then to get off and then you know but if you want to keep it and seeding means you're just letting people use that file they can access it I mean it's safe it's all encrypted when they do it it's just how this works but I hit don't seed and next and then it's gonna you know start automatically that means in your system startup you don't want that I don't do that okay and then I don't send that either so make sure you don't click none of those because this is sending you know to crosswire and if you're just using it for music you don't need all that and then hit and there you go and then click on this I will not use Frostwire for copyright infringements you just have to click on that because that's what letting them know you know so they don't get in trouble but when you're downloading music and stuff and just getting you know stuff like that it's you know they ain't gonna come knocking on your door for something like that so let's type in let's see what's um what do you guys want to listen to? Let's try David Gray. See, and they got David Bowie. Let's go with David Bowie. See. Okay, they'll have all his songs once you hit audio. See, and you can pick all from these. I mean, and these are right here with the little music symbol. That's just audio, like video. Like, here's video. Here's images and so on and so forth. So, but I just use it for this. And then you can display. I mean, you can, like right here, you can preview it. It's previewed, and it'll see. And then you, if you like it, you know, or if you don't like the song, you can skip down so you find a version that you like. And I mean, it has millions of songs, but it's a great little tool, and I recommend it. For all those that are trying to get some music, you know, to download to your phone or whatever. It's a great program. Thank you, guys. I hope you guys like this video. Um, you don't need a link for it. Actually, you can just go to the website. Thanks, guys.